Hi guys and welcome to Student Database Management System developed using MS Access. Let me show you guys how this works. Right here we have the the courses that are taken or the different degrees. And here we have the course. When you drop this down, you can select any of the course that you want. And all of the relevant information are right there. Over here, you can select either home student or overseas student, is in accommodation or not, whatever. And here, you just select any of the units, any of the subjects or modules that have been taken and enter the grades right here. And here, we have the total score, ranking, and so on. Details of the student and guidance details you can print if you want I'm not going to print anything but you can also save here you click that for the result and here that's to exit I'm not going to exit just yet and in here we have second tab the second tab that is where we just store all of the details of the student and you can also click on add new once you click on add new and enter student details in there there we go and here whatever the name of the student might be let's say the name is Grace Jones and address of Jones 45 Little Venice and Grace that's female date of birth let's say on the 10th 2000 mobile number of Miss Jones and email of Jones let's say at hotmail.com guidance of Jones their sister living in the same address yes you can enter that there yeah. and that is Jones as well so that can be let's say Kim Jones mobile number of Miss Kim Jones let's just copy something here and just paste that in yes there we go and email copy this paste that in there that will be Kim Day and the course that she stored in let's say information system and so on she happens to be a home student she's not and here accommodation no she stays at home exchange student no is she on scholarship no and here that is going to be first year of the bsc and this one will be zero 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 in there there's nothing in there and the subject that she's taking, we enter those subjects in here. Okay. And we are also meant to enter the grades. Enter the grades in here. There we go. There. All we then need to do is to click on total and there. This is just an overview guys and I'll see you guys with a full tutorial shortly.